Hello Capricorn, welcome to your romance reading for this week. If you'd like a personalised extended version of this reading, check out the description box below. Let's find out how love feels about Capricorn. Wow, a lot of feelings. How does love feel about Capricorn? How does love? Page of Swords, a discovery. D discovering you, getting to know you better. Alright, it's like I want to get to know you, Capricorn. I want to know you better. Beautiful. I feel like this is deja vu somehow. Tell me about Page of Swords here for Capricorn Spirit. Thank you. We have, for the long term, they're trying to make a decision about an offer of love. Somebody coming in offering love that's left them with a decision for their long term future. And it's about getting to know each other. All right. So you or your person still has a, an open portal to other people. All right. And this is the offer of love. Maybe you've made an offer of love and you're discovering that, you know, for the long term, you need to make a decision about approaching them. Are you going to go and approach them and make this offer? Let's find out. Alrighty, what is your love's secret desires towards you? What is Capricorn's love's secret desires towards Capricorn? Ace of Pentacles reversed. So the secret desires is that they really don't want anything stable and secure with you. So maybe they're playing the field, Capricorn, and they're quite happy being a free spirit. I think one of your readings did have that that you are both free spirits so uh, spirit tell me about ace of pentacles please for capricorn capricorn's loves secret desires towards capricorn all right they're, they're <laughs> cutting people out uh, your person is um discriminating who they can be with and who they can't and it's like um, a thing that they do. Uh, they, they're quite happily saying no and yes to people who are offering them dates and going out with them. I feel your person has a lot of options. High Priestess. This is sacred knowledge. This is, they don't want anyone to know. Uh, they don't really want stability with anyone. They don't want to settle down. They like to be free. They like to be out there and on their own. They like their life, but they do miss companionship and sometimes they like to come to you. All right, that's a secret design. All righty, so let's, clar let's get into how to bring more romance to this union. All right. Why do we have these? There's something you don't know about your person. They've got opposing... Yeah, they, if they don't like something or if they don't agree with something, they're just going to put on a fascade. They're not going to show you their real feelings. Um, yeah, they're not going to show... And I feel this is a bit of an obstacle for you because you like people to be genuine and upfront, but your person is not showing you their real feelings. How to bring more um, romance to to the union? Uh, I don't think they're interested um, in um, being real and being authentic and down to down to reality with you. I think they're more interested in just keeping the fascade going uh, and just seeing you when when it's appropriate. So we got um, the the. Uh, Obstacle is old woman, and old woman is rigid, a rigid way of thinking. This is just how they think, and there is nothing that can really be done about it <laughs> unless they decide to change their own mind, Capricorn. And this is your obstacle, okay, to bring more romance into your life with this person. Um, it might be worth thinking about um, not... I guess um, being too romantic because they're not showing you their real self and they you know they're just happy to see you sometimes because I feel that they're a very free spirit that's just my opinion but that's what came out in the cards okay 
let me know what you think of this reading i send you love peace and light always bye for now